Welcome back to Wolfenstein 2, The New Colossus. We're in a subway station in Nuclear, New York. And there's a bunch of radiation-resistant feral dogs down here. I don't think they're controlled by the Nazis. They don't seem to be wearing any of that typical Nazi armor and stuff. I think they're just feral. I'm going to try to avoid them. I don't want to have to kill them, but there is a lot of them, so I'm probably going to get spotted. Plus they're dogs, so I'm assuming they probably have really good eyesight. And smell? I'm gonna try to just go to the right. Saw me for a second, but we're but we're good, we're good. God, that was loud. Oh no, oh no, there's a dog straight ahead. Is it gonna come in? Oh it does. Shit. Oh, you can just go behind it. As long as it doesn't hear the splashing. I might be missing upgrade kits or whatever special stuff might be here, but that's fine. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, I think they smell me. They have their, like, nose to the ground, and they're both coming, which is very strange. Um, hmm. If I get up, they're definitely gonna see me. Hmm. Oh, it's collectible gold. Was this just a special place? Was that all that was? What is that thing? Is that a vehicle? I'm looking for... I'm expecting to see treads or something, but I don't see that. Is it some sort of hovercraft? I guess it's a gold version of that thing. Of the silverfish. Okay. I think I'm gonna have to shoot him. I'm sorry, doggies. No, that's really not what I wanted. In other news, these weapons are freaking cool. I also love just doing that. at me. Oh! There's actual Nazis here. Oh, fuck! Scared the shit out of me. That's probably all the dogs in this main room, right? Yeah, I think so. Alright, I might as well explore it now. Sorry, doggies. Not much in here. Oh. I think that's where I'm supposed to go. Oh, for fucking hell! God damn. Should have listened to Bombate. Just thinking that. They're right. There are crocodiles in New York. Did I just throw my axe? Nope, just hit it. Joe Montgomery.
Okay. You know what I think I need to try? I haven't used it in a while. Let's use this thing, huh? I think I overdid it. Oh, recharge thing. Is this a laser gun? Uh, this this one's not, but I think the other one is. Oh, nope. Commuter John's Journal. Monday, macaroni and cheese. Subway, 6.57. Too little sleep. Train crowded. Jenny burned the lunch. Tuesday, pork chops and potatoes. Subway, 6.56. Fat man snoring two seats away. Wish I could sleep too. Wow, this is exciting. Wednesday, ham sandwich apple. Subway, 732. Overslept. Boss will be pissed again. You're not a real American, buddy. What? Thursday, lasagna. 658. Read article about Nazi victories. We shouldn't fight them. Slept four hours tops. Friday, macaroni and cheese. Blah, blah, barely any sleep. Jenny burned the goddamn lunch. Asshole behind me yaps in Spanish. Just you wait. Okay, this is the journal of a... Hmm. Of someone who sounds like they went on a, a shooting rampage right after they wrote that or something. Or at least they were happy that the Nazis were coming. Now that's one of those doors that can be lasered, right? Or, no, maybe that's one of the ones that could be blown up. Damn, nice. See if there's some way to power up this old train. <gasps> Weapon upgrade, yes! Let's go with a marksman scope for the assault rifle. So, they're on the guns right now, but I'm assuming they're completely pretty much useless when you are dual wielding them, because right-clicking will just shoot the right or the left gun. It won't actually scope in. Yeah. So, you're going to want to single wield these, I think, if you're using that. There we go. Hmm. Not that much of a zoom, but I suppose it's not really a, like, a sniper rifle. Just like a medium long range kind of gun, not actually a full on sniper. Yeah, seems pretty good. So it's single shot. Yeah, single shot when it's in that mode. Easily switch back and forth. Okay. Well, I don't think there's any reason to leave it in scoped mode. Because if an enemy is kind of far away, to the point where I need to use the scope, then I probably have time to switch to the scope. So, I'll go like this. See if this is good enough. And if they're a little bit far away, I'll just scope in. Get rid of it. Oh, cool. You can even press the uh, switch the scope on and off while aiming down the sight. And it just smoothly transitions you into it. So, if I'm looking down here, and then I press the button, just automatically goes out, moves it, and then scopes you back in. So, you don't have to, like, release right-click, press it, right-click again. You can just go, like, hit him in the head, switch. Okay. Okay, train's got power. Let's find the controls and see if it moves. This one's not moving. Oh, no, it is. Just this way.
Nice. Thought that was gonna go much worse. Tons of pieces of armor around here. So what did that accomplish? Do we just try the other train or? I don't get it. Did I need to... Maybe I needed to move the train to get behind it? Ah. You know, I feel like we could do with some more environmental storytelling. I would like to see something in the vein of Fallout 4, where there's a bunch of skeletons, say, on the toilet, and there's a teddy bear next to him, and a bunch of cans of beer, Nuka-Cola, and some cigarettes. You know, that classic. June 27th, 1961. I don't know why it showed me the date. Ignore the pain. Ain't dead. So keep moving. That was quite an exit hey, from Cap, the train. You know. Oh, wow. Look at these stars. Anya, you see this all bright, all knowing? Oh, gosh, look. Oh, they're zooming away. Wait. William, Wait. why you just left? I don't know where. If you are on Fifth Avenue, the state building should be near. Was that the most powerful expletive that Blazkowicz could think of? His cock? <laughs> Giving me a lot of hatchets. Does it ever give you your hatchet back when you walk over them? Maybe it just straight up doesn't. What is that adorable thing? Scout Zeppelin. I'm hearing a drone or something. That damn body out of the way.
All right, where's that damn commander? There we go. Mama, you showed me postcards from your family in New York City. Wanted to go there. Just you and me. Christ, Blaskowitz is so broken. It's just sad. Something I forgot to mention in, I think it was the last episode. Blaskowitz was walking around the, the submarine. Eva's hammer. And I think it was when I was doing something for Anya. And Blaskowitz was saying something like, I wonder if Anya knows that I'm, I'm going to go the same way that Caroline went. Like, I'm going to die soon. He seems so sure of it. Like, not even a question. I'm going to die very soon. There's not much more left in me. I wonder why Blaskowitz feels that way? I mean, have they just given in to despair, or do they feel something? Like, can they just feel that the only reason they're able to do anything is because of the power armor? And without that, that their body is dying? Alright, I'm gonna look around for secrets. Nope, found a collectible. Danny Jordans. I think that's it for this place. Let's go up here. I think this is where I need to continue. Oh, yeah. That's a hell of a drop, though. Am I going to be okay? Oh, Come yeah. Big boy. Come to test the old man's metal. Got a boss fight. Looks like I have an opportunity to be sort of stealthy, though. Oh, heck yeah. Let's go ahead and get the jungle magazine. I'm finding the assault rifle to be extremely useful. Definitely my favorite weapon by far. It's just all around good for pretty much everything. So yeah, let's get the jungle magazine. Where's that damn commander? If I could shoot them from afar, that would be fine. I just need to kill the commander so they don't call for reinforcements. I don't have to do it stealthily, necessarily. There we go! Got him! Ha <laughs> ha! Shit. 
I didn't think it could reach up here. Alright. I think that's all the people. Let's save the game and then fight that thing. Hopefully that did something. Wow. Okay. Find a way to reach the top of the state building and make contact with the resistance group. Look for elevators, stairs, anything. The radiation levels should be acceptable at the top of the building. Sorry, yeah, doggy. Boy, son. Every second, a glory. So wait, am I skipping the robot, or what am I doing here? Might just be straight up skipping it. Go, 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 go. Fuck that thing. Just who the fuck are you, white boy? Oh, the resistance. Let me first make it absolutely clear that I am not a Nazi. What are you say? You say you're a Nazi? No, 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 I am not a Nazi. I'm not a Nazi, okay? Well, you ain't a white-ass fascist Nazi pig. Then you're either colored or you're a deviant. Now, you sure as hell ain't colored, so you're trying to pass as a deviant? You look like a deviant to you, Sister Grace? Nope. Hang on, hang on. I may not be a deviant. God, I told you he's a goddamn Nazi! Oh, fuck this. Oh, fucker! <laughs> Let me say this again. I ain't no goddamn... Nazi. Hey! <laughs> now you bring Super Special back in and you put him down right now, or I will shove this grenade so far up your ass, I'll be dancing and rejoicing as your entrails trickle down from the ceiling. You dig, man? Lady, <laughs> I got precious little time for your bullshit. We've been trying to make contact with your group. We're organizing for a revolution in America. We? The Chrysal Circle. Especially escort this motherfucker inside the house and get him a hot meal. Let me put this pen back in. Shit! Take cover! <laughs> Relax, man. He's just a duck. Jesus oh, Christ. He's got a sick sense of humor. Uh, dude, you're crushing me. Oh. Oh. Chili, okay? It's my papa's recipe. Ain't got no spoon, though. Oh, thanks. So what's, uh, with the chicken fats? Chicken <laughs> That's, that's my Faraday cage, man. You, you dig? It, it keeps the, the Nazi alien conspiracy from finding us. Oh. I almost got killed by William goddamn Blaskowitz. Yeah.
Do you mind? You were here when the bomb hit. Yeah, I was. I survived relatively unscathed because I was on the ground at the time. When I came up, looked like a vision out of Dante's Inferno. You know what I'm saying? I remember the main people just wandering through the smoke. I remember screams that went through the bombed out buildings like howling ghosts. And I remember this mother and son. This boy was blindly stumbling through the chaos. His arms were outstretched, calling out for his mama. And the heat from the bomb had melted the skin on his arms and they just drooped. Like he was wearing a shirt that was a couple of sizes too big. And I remember his mama. She was crawling to get to him. And the half of her body was all gone. It was just gone. What are you thinking in a moment like that? When you know you're losing everything you love. What are you thinking in a moment like that, huh? That's gonna leave a mark. Monsters did this. Not monsters. Men. Look, I'm sorry for your loss, Mr. Blaskowitz. For a little I spoke with Caroline, she seemed like a hell of a woman. She had balls of steel. Balls. And why is it that balls are always used as some fucking default definition of bad assery? small, little, delicate things, resting all snug and warm and cozy and comfortable in their little wrinkly wrapper of fucking skin. Shit. <laughs> that is a mystery. <laughs> What's not a mystery is the sweet juice they produce. Yeah, I got, I got a couple of my own on the way. Cute little guy. It's a girl. Oh, sorry. <laughs> what are you sorry for? What's up, Special? There's pigs, lots of them, coming up the stairs. They're gonna fucking army. Shh, the fuckers found us. Well, you got an escape strategy, Mr. Blaskowitz? Anya, we're gonna need immediate evac. Understood, William. Dispatching has one and has two for immediate extraction. Copy. Move your people to the roof. I'll stall the Nazis until our ride's here. Brothers and sisters, listen up! I need everybody to get up to the roof now. We're evacuating. And bring all the equipment you can carry. Come on, let's hustle, people! Come on, come on. Get your shit. You cool? Just make sure your people make it out. Come and fucking get me, you white ass fascist Nazi pigs. Okay. Wasn't terrible, Blaskowitz. Got to work on that a little bit, but started from cock and developed a little bit further than that. <laughs> All right. Oh, God, the music is... Oh, the music is just getting me pumped. The music is really good. I want to just keep playing right now, but I know I should stop because this is probably going to be a pretty long scene, I think. So I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I will be back soon to stop those white-ass fascist Nazi pigs. <laughs>